Yes, James, what's going on? So, what we're talking about today is like when people are sort of at, like, they, like we talk, whether it's clients um, or like sort of perhaps people I speak to in Messenger and different things, they'll ask sort of, ah, is sort of, is my eating okay? And I'm like, I don't know, like they'll send me sort of like what they're eating a typical day and then I'm just like, is this, is this okay? And I'm just like, I don't know, like it's sort of like the foods, yeah, they look okay, but I don't know amounts. I, I have no sort of tangible numbers to like sort of tell you if it's sort of good or bad and what I don't know what results it's producing. That's the other thing, okay? Because like you tell, you can tell me, okay, if it's good or bad because like what results is it producing? How is you like what, like is it moving you closer to where you want to be? Like wherever is your goal? Is it taking you closer towards that? Okay, is it helping you lose weight? Do you, what's your energy like from it? What's your sleep and recovery and performance like from it? Okay, um, so like if you just say to me, oh, I have a sort of like protein shake, then I have some sort of like chicken sandwich, then I have some sort of like, I'm, I'm just like, I don't know how much that is, okay? Um, I don't know, sort of serving size. I don't know how many of them are having. Is that like what, just one off day? Do you have it every day? What about weekends, okay? Like, again, and without sort of perhaps knowing calories, knowing protein, um, again, and without knowing what sort of result that's producing, like how long have you been doing that for, okay? All these different questions, because just like a one-off snippet of just like, oh, this is my, this is my diet, like, oh, I have a bit of fruit and nuts here. Oh, how many nuts, like? Like, was it a handful? Do you weigh it? Like, what, like, sort of, how much is it? Um, and then how, how does that factor in with the rest of your meals? Okay. Um, oh, like, how, how much is that? Oh, I don't know. It's, it's, I, uh, I don't know. I'm tracked. And I was like, yeah, I, I don't know. I can't really tell you. You can tell me, okay, if your eating is working, okay? Because it's just a case of, like, I can't tell you. You just tell me what result is producing, okay? How do you feel of that? Like, how's your, how's your shape changing if you're training? What sort of results are you getting from it? What's the outcomes it producing? Not real much. I'm not changing much. Or I'm gaining. I'm losing. Okay, then just you you know you need to change something then, don't you? Like uh, something needs to change. Um, but again, you can't really change stuff if you don't know the numbers. You don't know like where do I start? I'm like, I don't know, bro. Okay, let's just again if in those scenarios, like I said, right, let's just put it down in my fitness pal. Let's log down typical few days, like three to five days, um, including weekends. And let's see what our numbers are looking like. Let's see where we're at, okay? Just like looking at the bank statement before we start going on a spend. It's like looking at the survey fuel gauge before you decide if you need for petrol in. Okay, uh, uh, is waiting, okay? Right, let's log it down, put it in my fitness pal, okay? See what numbers we produce. How many calories is that? How much protein you hit in? Those are the main numbers you want, I, I'm looking at. And it's a case of, right, you're hitting this many calories and this much protein, okay? And it's giving you this result. You don't, this, the result isn't what you want. Okay, right. Assuming training train is taken care of, then we probably need to perhaps decrease calories slightly if you are wanting to lose weight and you're not. Okay, so just decrease those calories. And most of the time, it's increasing protein because protein is normally not high enough. Okay, people are just see too many carbs and not enough protein. Um, so those are the normal switches I make. Okay, it's just perhaps decreasing calories slightly. Okay, and increasing protein because when you log it down, like sort of. Um, like calories will be sort of perhaps oh fuck three thousand wow I didn't realize that yeah you need to sort of be, we need to be closer to two thousand so we need to start like let's drop it down by three four hundred calories to start off with um and how much protein fifty grams of protein right we need to start doubling that okay we need to work up um up that make that up into like the hundreds okay so we need to start to so bring those calories down increase our protein and to do that as well we'll probably have to sort of like um eat less. Uh, carbs and eat less fat so we can sort of get the protein into the calories um, and obviously from that we'll just so we can substitute the carbs for actual veg okay so what we'll find then the calories will come down protein will come up have a more veg and therefore again we can sort of see the outcomes which again it should be sort of perhaps yeah start losing weight then okay assuming everything else is taken care of in your lifestyle okay uh, and that's it so if, like when people say to me yeah like oh yeah i have this for breakfast this for lunch this for dinner and is it is it good? I'm just like, I don't know, what, what do you want? And you like I said, it's, it's always a case of you tell me, okay? How do you feel from it? How's your energy? How productive are you? Like, how do you perform in the gym? How do you recover from the gym? Okay? I can't tell you, I don't know enough about that. That doesn't give me much data, okay? Like, it's just like going to doctors and just saying, oh, I got a cough. Okay, like obviously disregarding today's climate to do a lockdown, but just like, okay, how long have you had it? Is there any other symptoms? Let me do some checks first, okay? Or go into the car, like garage, and just saying, ah, oh, is my car okay? And they're like, 
I don't know, is it doing everything you wanted to? And you're like, oh, well, no, it's not doing this. Well, okay, we need to do a few checks then, don't we? Okay, if it's not producing the outcome, if it's not going where you want or something, whatever, as fast as you want. Um, and that's it, okay? So if you sort of look going into diet, is right, okay? It's just, you tell me, okay? And then, let's say, if it's not getting what you want, then again, you put it into my fitness pal. Again, it's just, it's a, it's a free app, just a, a database of food. You can log stuff down and you get actual tangible numbers on like how much you're eating. So then you can see, right, I'm eating this much and it's producing this result, okay? And then if you want to sort of lose your weight, drop it by about four or 500 calories. And, and everything else stays the same, you probably lose weight, okay? And then like, so if you're not opposite way, if you want to gain weight, add four or 500 calories, okay? And yeah, it's pretty much as simple as that, okay? And then obviously there's more, more sort of to it, but that'll get you started. Um, so that's just a case of, yeah, it's might okay, it's just, I don't know, it's hard for me to say. I can't just sort of, I don't know, serving size, don't know, like how many days that's for, like is that on weekends as well? Or like, because weekends are completely a 180 for most people. So that it just disregards whatever you eat in the week anyway, okay? Let's look at your weekends. What do you eat on the weekend? I don't care about your week. Let's look at the weekends because that's where the make or break is for most, most people. Um, like most people logged in my fitness pal down on the week. They won't do it on the weekends or they'll send me the week and I was like, I don't give a fuck. Like it's lucky weekends. That's where we need to sort of a tackle. That's where the Achilles heel is. Let's focus on that. How can we improve that? Okay, do that. Um, and then like I said, it's a case of and just see what just tracking the results, okay? Take your body weight, take your tech measurements, take some photos, monitor your performance in the gym, and just see what sort of I've taken these actions, produce these outcomes. I want different outcomes, take different actions. Simple as that, okay? Hope that helps, gents. Any help you need, reach out.